What's up guys, in this short tutorial, I will show you how to boost your FPS and increase your overall performance when playing Enlisted on your PC. This should be quite an easy tutorial, everything you need will be listed in the description below. First, we will take a look at your in-game settings. Open up the game and navigate to your graphics settings. Set your resolution to your native monitor resolution and the window mode to full screen. I have set it to windowed as it's easier to record. Below, set the monitor option to your preferred monitor. In case you're using a powerful enough NVIDIA GPU, then set the NVIDIA DLSS option to performance. Otherwise, disable this option. Your resolution scale should be set to 100% to get the best in-game resolution. In case none of the next tweaks helped you out as much as you wanted, then you can reduce this option to around 85-90%, to especially for low-end graphics cards. Set the Temporal Anti-Aliasing Quality option to low, NVIDIA Reflex Low Latency to off, and disable VSync. Make sure to limit your frame rate to a value above your screen's refresh rate, but below the maximum FPS you can get. This will reduce the amount of resources you need to run the game. Below. Set your texture quality option to low. Disable anisotropy and the enhanced texture filtering option should also get reduced to a minimum. Set the shadow quality option to low. Disable shadows from effects. Set the global illumination quality option to medium and all of the other graphics quality settings below should be reduced to a minimum to increase your performance while playing the game. Don't forget to apply your changes. When this is done, you can close the game and open up your task manager. In order to reduce the CPU utilization from other programs, I suggest you to end some programs from running in the background, which you don't need when playing the game. But make sure to only end programs from running, which you know won't break your operating system. In the Startup tab, you can additionally prevent programs from starting up on system boot. You can now Close the game and exit out of your task manager. When this is done, search for Game Bar to open up the Game Bar system settings. Here, uncheck the recording option and in the Captures tab, make sure to additionally disable the background recording option. These settings will only reduce your performance. If you want to record your gameplay, then I suggest using OBS Studio or an external capture card if you lack performance. Next, make sure that your graphics driver is up to date. I suggest using the GeForce Experience application if you're using an NVIDIA GPU, but you can also use the AMD driver suit. Depending on how frequently you're updating your GPU, this tweak can make the biggest difference. In the Drivers tab, simply click on Download and the application will automatically download and install the latest driver. When this is done, search for Update to open up your Check for Updates System Settings window. Here, click on Check for Updates and after downloading the latest OS update, make sure to restart your PC. Next, right-click your desktop and select NVIDIA Control Panel. You can do the same step with the AMD driver suit. Here, navigate to manage 3D settings and then program settings. Select to add a program to customize and then add unlisted from the program list. Below, we will change a few settings. Make sure that the CUDA setting is set to your main GPU. Set the power management mode to prefer maximum performance and set the texture filtering quality to performance. When this is done, search for graphic settings and open up your graphic system settings. On this window, select browse and your file explorer will open up. From here, navigate to the drive on which you saved the game on, program files, and listed Win64. Make sure to select the unlisted application and then add it to the program list. Once it's added, you can change the options of the application so that the graphics preference is set to high performance. Don't forget to apply your changes. 
Lastly, I suggest deleting your temporary files, as these can induce lag if your hard drive is cluttered. Search for percentage temp percentage and hit enter. This folder contains all of your temporary files, saved by your programs and should be deleted. We can safely delete everything in this folder. Some files might remain, so just leave them there. A link to this wallpaper will be in the description below. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.